what is up everybody feed the shark back here once again to provide you guys with a full game commentary and i'm sorry if my mic's a bit too close to my mouth i'll fix that right now um but we're gonna be playing some galactic Zir in the mid lane since as you can tell i almost already bought my items by accident or one of them at least i bought my doran's ring but yeah we're gonna buy doran's ring two potions and our trick and then head to mid lane uh Zir is actually really really good right now so i want to play him for you guys um just to make like Pretty much let you guys know that Azir is like top tier in the mid lane right now. So he is really good. Hopefully we can do good against this Katarina. Um, Katarina is also really good. As well as Cassiopeia. Um, those are like I think the three main, main mid laners. I think there's a... Oh yeah and Cho'Gath. Cho'Gath's extremely good right now as well. Um, in the mid lane. Because he's basically just farm and sustain. Farm and sustain. So it's like really easy to play him. And he's just really efficient. He's really um, good at the game I guess. Um... But it looks like we do have a Yi that's AFK currently. Let's give him a couple pings here. So he knows um, he is jungle. So I don't know. Whatever. He took DP. So I guess he's going for those late game um, back doors. But yeah, we have a Lo Leona support master. He jungle, Jinx, ADC, Azir, mid, Shen, top. They have a Katarina mid, Nocturne, jungle, Janna support, Fizz, top, and Twitch, ADC. So yeah, those are two team comps for today, guys. Hopefully you do enjoy this gameplay. I've been trying to get some gameplay on the PvE as well since they do have the Hexakill. Um, but like, I haven't really been feeling like, feeling it like, I don't know. I just haven't really been feeling like doing PBE content. Like I kind of just want to do a couple normal games and stuff like that. It's much more enjoyable for me. Um, in my opinion, at least. All right. So she's going to get all those low, most likely just so she can go for the Q. Yeah. Like that. As I thought, I'm going to summon. Oh, I didn't even upgrade my sand soldiers yet. What am I doing? I'm stupid. All right. I got that. Also got a ranked fives commentary for you guys. If you guys want it up let me know it's also in his ear commentary so i don't know if you'd want it up let's give her a couple auto attacks there um let's get this minion right here oops whoa some lag right there all right but we're csing perfectly so that's good um katarina's probably gonna throw a q out, out sooner or later i mean oh no we missed that qq it's okay all right so we got our q now as well um so that's good We're gonna throw our soldier out We're gonna q her there there we go get some poke off on her Kind of, I think we missed a CS or two there as well in the process. It's just, I guess it's fine. It's not too bad. All right, so we're going to get that. So we have 10 farm to her 9. Um, she is farming a bit better than us, I think, at least. I think so. Um, but then, I don't know. Like, Kenner is pretty safe to farm with. Like, you can just stay back and queue all day. And especially since she started um, Boots, she has a lot of potions for sustain. So it's just, in general, really easy to farm with Katarina, at least when you build like that. Alright, so we're going to get all of that. Now we have 17 farm to her 12. If she gets all these, she'll have 17 as well. So, that's that. We're just going to get this in a second. No, actually, yes, we are. Never mind. Alright, we're going to set up a soldier here. Kind of zone her off the CS. Stop auto attacking. There we go, get that. And yeah, this is pretty much laning phase as Azir. You kind of just want to farm up. Um, nothing too special. Going to watch out here because she does have her Q on me. So, I don't want her to jump on me. Going to Q right there. Get another auto off on her. Get another auto off on her. One more? No. I thought that was one was going to go through the minion. Oh, we kind of messed up there. No. All right. There we go. Um. So, yeah. I actually got a hexakill too on PBE, but I guess it didn't go through because I think you're supposed to get a hexakill and, like, everyone's alive. I think I got a hexakill after someone spawned. So, pretty much just an ace. That kind of stinks. I was planning to record that game, and then I just stopped recording because, like, I was having a terrible game. But, like, my commentary was off, too, so... <clears throat> yeah that kind of stinks so we're gonna stop autoing that there we go get all those and yeah 28 farm to her 21 so we're definitely winning in the farming department which is good especially because we're up against a katarina so for this matchup um we're pretty much going to be waiting to level six i don't think i can kill her since she has so much pots um it's going to be kind of hard looks like a fight actually going off between the um nocturne right here all right gonna go over here no no dude no she has red buff. Red buff, please. Alright. I don't think I can kill her here. There we go. Getting some poke off on her, though. That's for sure. Alright, so that's kind of sad. She kind of got first blood on the Yi. It kind of stinks there, but that's fine. I mean, she has red buff now, um, which isn't the best for me. And I kind of ignited randomly there as well. I kind of panic ignite ignited, which isn't good. But whatever. I mean, what can you do, boys? What can you do when it happens to you? What can you do when it happens to you? Alright, let's get that. Get that. Back out here. Um, looks like Jinx actually picked up a kill on the Janna, which is good. 
So we're actually going to go back here. Um, not much we can do. It's probably going to try to push the wave, but <clears throat> as a Katarina, I don't think there's much potential in pushing the wave. So what we're going to want to do is rush the Chalice, that's for sure, because it gives us some magic resist, some mana. And that's definitely what you want against the Katarina. I mean, what else can you say, really? So yeah, Chalice, three potions, um, works out for us. Gonna go to mid lane. Hopefully get we're gonna get these, hopefully. I think we yeah. Yeah, yeah. We're definitely gonna get them because the wave's gonna stop around here. <clears throat> there we go. And Katarina is actually level five. Still with that red buff, obviously. Um it'd be cool if Master E could gank, but I mean I don't think he can really do anything when he ganks anyways, so Master E is kind of a useless jungler in that sense. She did hit level sixty for me, so gotta be careful with that. Gonna go in like that. Go for go for some poke. Not gonna be able to get this one. Gonna auto this one once. Should be able to get it. No, I'm not, because I'm too weak, apparently. Alright. Can I get this one? Yes, I can. Alright, there we go. Got all of those, or most of those, at least. So she has 40 farm to my 41. Um, and then if I push this wave up fast enough, she will be getting out-farmed, I think. So, alright. Push this up. Can we push it up in time? I don't, I don't know if we can. I don't know if we can. Yeah, we should. Have. This should reach the turret, I believe. Looks like this guy's actually going for that counter jungling on the Nocturne. I don't think that's the smartest thing to do. Because I think Nocturne can easily 1v1 one, one a Yi early game. So I'm just going to go try to roam over here. Um, throw a ward down right here. Just, just so we have some vision of Nocturne's jungle. Got some deep wards in. And then we have a ward in river as well. So that's good. Um, Katarina is going to be pushing up this wave. I can get all of these though, I'm quite sure. Easily. So that's good. Auto that. Auto that. Oh, never mind. Apparently I can't get those. QQ. Alright, we're gonna get that. Gonna not get that one. And we're gonna pop a potion here because they're kinda, you know, kinda getting up, you know, we got some damage on us, which is what I wanted to say in the beginning. What the hell am I saying? Alright, we're gonna get that. I haven't actually played at Zero in a long time on my channel. Um quite a long time actually. Alright, so we're doing like no damage. She has an easy large rod, so I kinda wanna be careful. Because I am definitely going to get wrecked in a fight if I mess with her. So, yeah. Just back off here. Alright, so this one should be gettable to that. Going to get that one. Not going to get that one. Not going to get this one because freaking minions. Wrecking on my CS. She has 54. I'm going to call Mia because I have no clue where she is right now. I doubt Nocturne is giving her blue. I mean, that would be just useless as a blue buff. Um, to give to a Katarina has no mana for CDR it'd be good. Oh, I called that Mia boys. I called it Is she gonna die here? No, I don't think so cuz twitch. Oh She's actually not even gonna be able to get a kill right there And I may just be coming in for a successful roam right here. Everyone is low. This may just work out for us In the end it may just work out for us. I don't know what's worded and what isn't worded though Which oh jinx actually picking up that kill gonna come in right here there we go. Gonna ult. Oh, and I just failed my ult like crazy. Is that triple? That's a triple kill for Jinx. I love that. Oh, is she gonna die? Yes, she is. That's kind of sad. I failed my ult really bad. I always try to do that with my ultimate. Like, you pretty much just stand here and then you ult if they're behind. Sometimes it gets them. But I think I'm gonna stop doing that because, like, most of the time it doesn't get them. Unless they're, like, right beside them when you ultimate. But yeah, we're gonna get that turret. So that actually ended up working out really well. And we're gonna get this early dragon. Let me just push this lane up for the boys. But the boys, let's go. Let's go help this guy out with dragon. So we can get this early dragon, get this early advantage going. And yeah, let's hop over here. There we go. Tank a little bit for Master Yi. Because, you know, this guy's getting a bit low. He shouldn't... No, no, get out, dude. No, he's going to die? No, he isn't. Should be fine. I'm just going to tank for him. There we go. Alright, he actually almost died there. That was kind of close. But that's actually really good. Jinx is 4-0 right now. So, yeah, as you guys... I don't know if you guys saw or what or not, but... Jinx actually got nerfed on the PBE, so she's not, like, she's getting a bunch of nerfs, just hitting her from left and right, like, she's getting nerfed out the ass, so, Jinx isn't too, too good right now, um, at least on the PBE, she's not the best, but on live servers, she's still pretty good, the only, uh, nerf is her alt on the live servers, so I'm actually ahead of Katarina in, um, experience it seems, because I am level 8, she is level 7, and in farm, as well, especially if I'll be able to get all of these, Definitely will be quite a bit ahead of her, so that will definitely help us out. There we go. Get most of these and go for these now. Oh, we're not going to get that one. No. Okay. It's fine. We're going to just pop a potion. Actually, that was kind of inefficient of a potion. We barely even had any health missing. 
All right, gonna do that. There we go. We're getting that poke off on her now. Doing quite a bit of damage because we got that fiendish codex. Finally got some AP on us. So those two assists did help us out. Kind of messed up our ultimate. Would have probably been a double kill for us if we didn't mess up our ultimate. But I mean, at the end of the day, the two kills were on our team. So that's all that matters. That's all that matters, boys. All right, so we're just going to try to farm here. All these minions are going to be pushed up to her turret. Probably going to just get them all anyways. All right, I'm going to queue over here. There we go. Like that poke. She has one more potion. And that's her last potion that she just ticked. And I'm sitting here with pretty much full mana. So I'm pretty healthy. Looks like Leona is actually right here. To help us out with the gank probably. Uh, but I don't think I don't think uh, she can. So I'm just going to ping her off. No point of even coming. Katarina is coming right here though. There we go. Going to go in on her. There we go. Not go in but just get some poke. And yeah. She's, she's pretty low right now. So she is pretty low. Nocturne's right over there. There we go. Getting some poke off on him. One more minion. And yeah, I think Katarina actually backed. Unless she actually went in. Don't know though. We could die this guy. I don't know. I think we should just get turret though. And then I can um, also just use my passive on this in a second. Yeah, I'm just going to use my passive right here. <coughs> Recreate this turret. Alright. Push these minions, boys. Don't let them attack my turret. This turret actually does so much damage. Like, I don't understand how it's like a normal turret. If you someone can explain that. Like, it says... It doesn't say anything. I don't think. Disintegrates over one minute. Yeah. Like, it does so much more damage than a normal turret, it seems. And at least in my opinion. Um, but it looks like everyone's actually in the mid lane. So I'm going to target that top turret. Let Shen know to get that. Because, you know... There we go. Don't let these minions attack my turret, boys. Get those. There we go. Turret gets me CS2. So I'm at 92 CS. Katarina's at 67. I have two assists. Zero deaths. So I'm quite ahead of her now. Um, and I'm ahead of her in experience as well. <clears throat> so that's always good. Alright, that W landing right there. Q landing. Get some poke off on her. Watch out though. This Nocturne's right here. Turret's almost down. So gotta kind of watch out. Yeah, let's just get out now. Like, if the turret was up, that would have been a good time to fight. But my turret just got down, so no point of fighting without a turret. Because <clears throat> pretty much, like, that turret does so much work in fights. It surprises people, but, like, when it's not up, it's kind of like, meh. Like, kind of like, you don't really want to even fight. Well, I mean, you could, you want to fight. Zero's not useless without his turret, but... Here we go. Let's do that. Sleesha Sky... Ha! <laughs> we actually ended up taking it, too. Ripping pieces, Nocturne. Ripping pieces. Um, I'm just going to throw a ward down here. <clears throat> and I think we should be good to back. Yeah, we have enough for this. We, we don't... Oh, uh, actually, no. Nah, screw it. I'm not backing yet. We don't even have enough for... Um, what I want to get is sorcer Sorcerer's Boots or Shoes. And then, as well as my Finish My Chalice. So that's my goal right here. I'm right, going to E here. What the hell is this Nocturne doing? Does this Nocturne just go on a suicide mission? Or what? I'm going to get that. There we go. Katarina sh might be here. She might be roaming bot or trying to roam bot. I have no clue. Yeah, she's trying to roam. And I think I'm dead. Yeah, I'm dead. I'm definitely dead. I knew that was going to happen too. Wow. As you saw there when it said, uh, or I don't know if you guys saw that, but when it said an enemy or an ally has been slain when I died, um, Katarina had that mastery thing right under. So scumbag Katarina had champion mastery on cat. That's some scumbag stuff. We had enough for both items, but I kind of wanted a roam bot. That's the thing. So, whatever. Uh, Katarina got another kill on Master E. That kind of stinks. That's pretty bad. Wow. Ripped in pieces. No more cat feed blocks. <laughs> I don't want Cat to get any more fed. Like, she's 3-1 and one now. So, now she's ahead of me. Um, So, you know. I think... I don't know. I think if I ulted, maybe she would have not killed me there but i kind of just panic flashed i think if i ulted those it would have disrupted her ultimate and then <clears throat> maybe some more blades wouldn't have killed me but whatever i mean it's pretty much just panic like i said and just did it just happened gonna do that get most of these here oh cat and you have ludens that's a good rush on cat hate it i hate it i hate it because you know everything on katarina's op is crap so you know I'm just going to ping that I'm coming. Maybe this guy will give me blue. Can I? Or no? Uh, yeah, I can apparently. 
There we go. Thank you. All right. Um, Katarina is still mid. Actually, we can just take Dragon straight up right here. Why not? Just take Dragon. Got both my soldiers attacking it. Mastery is coming right here. Hopefully Nocturne. Nocturne. Okay, no, we got it. Whoa, whoa, this E is going ham. This E is going ham right now. The heck? <clears throat> did she flash or did she E? Oh, yeah, I think she E to Nocturne. Never mind. Let's just throw a war down here. There we go. Jen is right there. Gotta get that vision, boys. Vision wins games. All right. Um... So yeah, now I'm not doing too, too well. I mean, I'm still CSing pretty well for Decaterina. So, and I do have my passive up for my turret. So, that will help. No, loot and cycle, please. I actually hate that item on cat. So overpowered. Well, let me just put a soldier down right here. This guy's doing those things. Oh, no, he got it. No, I wanted to steal it for a second time. All right, I can actually put my turret up any time here. So, whatever. And we got vision on this now, since my turret's up. So that's good. Um, I'm just going to pop a potion here. Oh my god, how did Nocturne's Q get me right there? Watch out. Watch out, Leona. No. Oh, this guy is probably dead, actually. No, I just messed up my ultimate so badly. I just messed up my ultimate so badly. My turret's right there, still doing work. Did yeah, I killed him too. Yes. If this guy gets aggro, yeah, he's dead. No! One more auto, please. Jinxie, no. Oh, well. I got two kills from that. I, I messed up my ultimate again. I don't know what happened there. Kind of sucks, but whatever. Sorry for that display of, you know, bad play there, guys. Did not mean to do that. Um, But, yeah. Let's just go for... I don't know. Oh, yeah. Let's just go for Zonia's next. I always love rushing... Depends who I'm going up against. If I'm going up against someone AP in lane, I get Chalice. If not, I get Merlin Omicron. Um, but after either of those, I like rushing Zonia's on Azir. I used to build attack speed like Nasher's Tooth as well, but it's really not good on Azir. Um, there's much better items that could fill those item slots. Because it's either you get attack speed or you just get more AP, which your soldiers chunk for more, but they don't attack as fast. Or you get attack speed and they attack fa attack faster, but they don't chunk as um, hard. So it's either or, but to be honest, I kind of like it now with just getting straight AP. Just not worrying about that attack speed. That's the best way. Alright, so... But yeah, by by no means is my farm really good. I'm just saying it's much better than Katarina's. Or not much better, but better than Katarina's. So, yeah. Don't be like, ah, oh, your farm's trash, though. My farm's not great. Not great right now. But, you know, we can... Oh, no. I leashed it for them. Ripped in pieces. <clears throat> at least I wasted his um, Raptor buff by putting a ward there. Or at least not wasted it, but technically he was... Nah, actually, technically, that was good for him, because he got free gold off of that. Alright, so this guy's right here. There we go, he's dead. Oh, Leona got the kill now. Oh, well, that's fine. He died, that's all that really matters. All that really matters. This isn't Call of Duty, boys, so we don't care about KSing. There we go. Save the turret with just three health. Holy crap, that clutch save. I actually hate when turrets are like that on the enemy team. Just like, oh my god, three health. Just... Feel the auto attack on that turret. Alright, so we have our ultimate up again. Hopefully we won't mess it up this time. I keep trying to derp it up, make those Azir plays, but you know. Shout out to my boy, Unknown Martian. He's an amazing Azir player, if you guys don't know him. Um, he made like a bunch of Azir montages. Actually, let's just go over here. Get this guy. There we go. Um, yeah, he went invisible, so that's his Q down. Can we get this turret though? Do not know if we can get this hurt. This guy's shield's about to go down as well. So he'll just get dived. Or dove. I mean. Dove. Dove. I mean. So yeah. My passive is up in 38 seconds. So that's good. That's going to be make make it much easier for us to siege. Oh what the hell. This Leona's going in right now. Holy crap. What the hell is this guy doing? No. No. I'm going to ult. And I'm dead. Because Katarina got the resets. I like that champion. I love that champion. Very fair. Perfect display of why Katarina is broken as hell and should be removed from this game. Um, but you know, we'll just we'll try not to be too salty here. We got our boy Shen split pushing top lane. Our Yi should be doing more. Like this guy's just sitting in jungle farming the whole game. Yi, 
upgrade your jungle item, dude. Yeah, like this guy should upgrade his jungle item. I don't understand. <laughs> it's 20 minutes into a game. Like I thought he would have Devourer since he's farming so much, but I guess he didn't upgrade it at all. It's kind of it's sad to be honest. That means like he was just farming for no reason. Like he should be farming for Devourer if he's gonna be farming all game. But whatever, to each his own. He did pick up Twitch right now, so that's good. <clears throat> he still does a lot of damage as well, so, I mean, whatever. So we got our passive up. I don't want to waste it on this turret, though. That will just be a waste of time, you know? A waste of time. Oh, no. Can I get that? Yes, I can. And I'm going to Q through here. going to E. I'm getting all lows. Oh, and my lord. Can we please just do something about this Katarina? Can we do something about this cat? There we go. Got some poke on him. Right there. Um, there we go. Got some poke on her as well. Jinx is all thing. Not going to be able to kill her though. Not, not enough damage either way. Even if that hit, that wouldn't have killed. So, it's whatever. Oh, look at those minions. I want those minions. Oh, no. I got zero. Not even worth for me. Alright, so, yeah, our Jinx is actually doing really well. Her farm's not the best, but, I mean, she's 7-1, so... How can you complain with a 7-1 Jinx, you know? We're not expecting those LCS farming farming stats. Oh, no, watch out. I don't want I do not want to get wrecked by her again. For the What? Why is she exhausting? What the hell? I didn't really want to go in on that. We got Dragon, though, so, I mean, that's a pretty good distraction for Drag. I think that was worth it. Worth an exhaust, you know, worth an exhaust. All right, I'm just going to throw a ward down here. We have some vision of that as well. Still do have my passive up, so I can set up my turret anytime we want. Can't actually set up my turret here, but I kind of want to set it up in a fight because my last two turrets, I mean, my one turret, like, did a lot of work, but my other turret didn't do too much. Kind of just died. Sometimes when, like, I'm autoing stuff too, like, sometimes I summon my turret randomly, so it's kind of annoying because I right-click the turret spot by accident. And I'm like, Ripperino and Pepperino. It, I'm actually doing quite a bit of damage here. I actually have my Zonias. What the hell? This guy's actually going ham. Can I? I can't set up my turret. There we go. Got her with that ultimate. But she just got to reset, I'm pretty sure. I'm just going to set up my turret right here, just in case we, they're going to dive. There we go. I'm in with the slow. I don't know if we can do too much here, though. There we go. Double kill for me. Can we do anything here? No. There we go. Triple kill. Can we get the quad? The quad? The dream? No, we cannot get the quad. Oh, well. That was nice. That was nice. The turret zoned off um, pretty much all of them at the end. Towards the end of that fight. So, Karinari is still pretty, still down for quite a bit. So, alright. Let's just do our W for that turret damage. And we should be able to get this inhib as well. Should be autoing the inhib, but I just want to clear these minions. Hate, I hate when minions. Okay, there we go. We're gonna get out here. Don't do not want to die to that guy. I don't not want to die. Donut, and we got the blue buff from Twitch as well, so that also helps us out because blue buff is always good on Z. Remember that, boys. Blue buff is life. Alright, so let's just go get this. It is th this guy still didn't even upgrade his jungle item. Come on, dude. He's like my one friend that says I sell my jungle item. Like, what the hell? <laughs> Rip selling a jungle and I'm just going to leash him here. Hopefully I don't take it. There we go. Okay, I'm going to go back. We got 2,000 gold in the bank, so we're going to go buy some um, some items. We're going to go finish the Zonias. Probably get a nice large rod as well. Get that Rabadons going or building up here. So yeah, now we're doing a lot more damage than we were during that fight as well. So that was a really good ultimate by me because I pretty much stopped Katarina's ult as soon as she started it. And then that forced her to Zonias. Pretty much just be useless for that portion of the fight. Um, which was definitely good, obviously. And yeah, now Katarina should be pretty easy to deal with, I guess. Just focus all the CC on her, and that's pretty much, like, her pretty much being gone. If any of you guys are low elo, well, I, I'm pretty sure a lot of the people that are watching me are probably low elo, since, like, a lot of the community is low elo. Not to sound arrogant, I'm, I'm platinum, I'm not even that high. Um, but if you guys are watching this and Katarina's being used a lot, I just zone for no reason. I clicked the one on the side of my mouse. Oh no. Ripping pieces. You do not want to do that. Um, but if you guys are 
whatever, struggling against Katarina, always remember to focus CC on her because once CC is focused on her, she's pretty much useless at that point. <clears throat> That's what a lot of low elo players don't understand in um in ranked and stuff like that. With Katarina, it's all about focusing the CC um on her at the right time. So pretty much just key with Cat. Oh no, we didn't get that. I'm gonna watch out here though, cause Fizz is you know Fizz is trying to get in my asshole right there. Popping his E though. Look at look at that visual glitch. Like, why is there so much visual glitches with, um, or so many visual glitches with this guy? What's this man doing? Where was he running to? He's confused. Alright, I gotta go. Is the blue buff up? Yes, it is. Time to get this blue buff. There we go. There we go, boys. Blue buff for us. And Master Yi actually ended up getting out, too. It's actually surprising. This guy was just running into the base. I don't know for what reason, but that's, I don't know. He's doing that. It looks like someone's actually pinging Baron, I guess. He wants to do Baron. I I mean, we could do Baron. I'm just going to go get home guard so I can get there as fast as possible. Let's... Let's Baron. Baron. Like, we could. So, you know, that's always good. Um, we It'd be preferable if we had a pink ward. Um, but Leona has scanner as well. So, <clears throat> that works. Alright, um, they did have that warded. So maybe they do know we're baroning, possibly. Alright. Where's our jungler when you need him? On the other side of the map. Sadly. Alright, we got Baron though anyways. Without our jungler. Screw you, Master G. Screw you. Ooh, what the hell these guys are? These guys are actually right here. What the hell is this guy doing? Just sort of just died. Oh, and Master G's coming in for the double kill. Clean up. Can he get more or no? Can he get more kills? Oh, the knock-up landing. It's going to probably stop him from getting any more kills at this point. Yeah. Oh, well, that's fine. Still have my passive up so we can set up the turret whenever we want. Which is good. Look at that inhibitor rebuilding. Wow. Rebuilding itself to pieces. Or not to pieces. From pieces. All right. Can we end here? That's a question. Oh, no. I got to get out. Katarina's right there. I don't want her to start cleaning up stuff, you know. Start janitoring the whole place. Getting that reset going. Oh, and she got a reset. Probably another kill for her as well. There we go. Gonna alter back. That's what I wanted to do. That's what I wanted to do, baby. Sometimes it just doesn't work out, though. It just doesn't work out. There we go. Gonna do this. Gonna Zonia's as well. We do have our um, Shen here as well. And that's Twitch. Dead. That's a dead rat right there. Got the zone. I had to flash out right there though. I didn't think I was going to make it if I didn't flash because I think they're still all going for me. So at that point, flash was necessary. Looks like this Jinx is just going ham. Does not care. Got two soldiers to do damage to his turret as well. So this may be game right here. Alright, so looks like that's actually GG guys. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this full game commentary as Galactic Zier. Please leave a like on the video if you did. And remember to subscribe to Jones and Frenzy if you're new to my channel. As well as check out my runes and masteries in the description. As well as my Facebook, Twitter, and Twitch, baby. Um, but yeah, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Hopefully you're having an awesome day. And I'll see you guys in my next video.